what can a guy who knows some Java, who doesn't know anything about Raspberry Pi, uh, build in a few hours? Uh, if you take a, uh, all I could do, I got, all I could th think of was maybe get an LED light to light up, right? Uh, I'd be happy if I could get, get that done. Uh, so build a remote control, uh, build a remote controller to run on any web capable device. Because this phone, it's not a Java capable phone. You know that this company, I don't think they will ever support Java, right? So Java FX or whatever Java based client will never run on this. Uh, but I really want to use this to, to, to control it. Uh, so I thought, okay, what can Java do? Java can easily let us, uh, enable any web based device to, to, to work. Um, and, and the thing about this robot is, it's already pre-built. Mini already built, uh, a lot of the, hard, difficult stuff and expose it in the, in the form of things API. So I thought, okay, maybe I can use it to communicate with it. But the, the, the rest based API wasn't that user friendly. Uh, I wanted something that I could click a button and if the camera, you want to see it. So there's an up, down, left and right. And there's a distance indicator to say, okay, how far are you from uh, an obstacle in front of you? So. So I thought, okay, maybe I can do something to see if I can be a robot that I can control remotely using Wi-Fi on the same network and see if it's smart enough to not destroy itself if I forget to stop it, right? So, um, so I tried, tried to build something from ground up and say, okay, within a few hours, I got something working in my browser, right? Um, the app server that I have just serve up a simple HTML page um, to Basically, um, load up a simple web page, run some jQueries to hit a uh, REST based uh, uh, API to talk to this uh, robot. Um, now, that that was nice, but the app server was running on my laptop. What happens if my laptop is not running? Then this robot won't run, right? So, talk to Mini, talk to uh, uh, Ra yeah. Mara, and say, okay, what else can we do about it? Right? Okay, maybe we can run the app server on the Raspberry Pi. Well, it turns out that Raspberry Pi can run Tomcat. So I loaded Tomcat, deployed the war, just like that, onto Raspberry Pi. Started up the, started up the server, and this is it. So just to illustrate how easy it is to, to build a robot and remote control it uh, from a phone that doesn't run any Java or anything complex. Well, this, this is pretty complex, but not, no, not any Java base. Oh, that's right. Uh, so it's running, it's running, and running. Okay, it stopped by itself. So because the sensor automatically detected that there's an obstacle in front of it, and all the logic is not on a robot, it's on this phone. Okay, very simple jQuery based logic. Just a few lines of code in a few hours, you guys can do it too. Thank you. Whoa.